After blowout wins yesterday by Koyamaka and College of the Canyons, these two teams square off in the Clash of Canyons championship game. A 2 p.m. start a little later than that. As the previous game was a little late, so we get started now here on the Cougar Sports Network at Lee Smelzer Court inside the Cougar Cage. I'm Matt Robinson, happy to have you along with us as always. Should be an interesting matchup between these two. They played last year in the Clash at Canyons. And College of the Canyons came away victorious. So Koyamaka looking to try and exact a little bit of revenge here today as they go in game number two of the day and the championship game of the Clash at Canyons tournament. For Wab Grakowski, the head coach of Cuyamaca, the starting lineup will be Xavier Rubio, Jameer Sykes, Jonathan Dooley, Sergio Franco, and Patrick Brinkman. On the other side, Howard Fisher in his 24th season as the head coach, 24th year, we should actually say, as the head coach of College of the Canyons. Of course, the 2020 year, COVID year, there wasn't really a season. So his 24th year as the head coach, he's going to send Jacob Gonzalez, Isaiah Baptista, Isaiah Ortega, Mason Savory, and Andrew Ezenwa to the floor to start for COC yesterday, a 101 to 83 win over Barstow. It looked very good throughout the contest and really picked it up late in the ball game. Got double uh, double figure performances from Jonah Elfara, Mason Savory, Isaiah Baptista, and JT Barnett. Baptista leading though with 24 points in 33 minutes with five rebounds, five assists, three steals in the ball game. He was the leader for College of the Canyons. Barnett was 16 points in 16 minutes off the bench, had a nice game. He added another 10 point performance from Jonah Alfara, who shot 75% uh, from the floor, six of eight for 12 points, as he had uh, 21 double figure games last year. So picks up right where he left off a season ago. On the other side for Kuyamaka, Xavier Rubio had 12. Uh, Jonathan Dooley with 13, Sergio Franza with 16, and Patrick Brinkman led the way with 17 as they were able to climb away with a victory over Oxnard in the opening game of the Clash at Canyons yesterday. It'll be Brinkman and Savory to jump. Tip one by College of the Canyons in their yellows today, moving to our left. Imaka in the baby blues. Attacking to our right here in the championship game. Baptista trying to pick up where he left off yesterday. Misses on the three ball. Savory couldn't come down with the board as he skied just a touch too early. So an empty possession on their first possession for College of the Canyons. And here's Xavier Rubio for Kuyamaka. Got it to Dooley. Dooley yesterday 13 points on 5 of 11 shooting. Sykes fouled on the floor goes against Baptista. So first foul comes 33 seconds into the ball game and it'll be a 20 second reset here for Kuyamaka as the Coyotes will get it into Brinkman. Rubio on the far side of the floor. Now to Brinkman working against the Zenwa. Sends it a Dooley, they'll work it around Sykes. Sykes will put it on the floor for a moment then back to Rubio. Gonzalez closing out on him. Rubio able to get into the paint and his little shot no good. Savory's outlet deflected. Dooley a jumper that doesn't fall. Offensive board for Franco. Kuyamako reset once again. Sykes trying to drive, stops up, turn around, jumper doesn't fall. And Zenwa able to come away with the rebound and got it to Mason Savory. So Canyons relieves a bit of the pressure here after three offensive opportunities for Kuyamaka. And then is Enwa going to be called for a foul as Rubio was able to step in front and take away the lazy pass from Mason Savory. And it picks up a second foul on College of the Canyons in the first two minutes of the ball game. Xavier Rubio back to work for Kuyamaka here. So he'll bring it up to the near side of the floor. Savory trying to cover him as the Cougars switching in the zone right now. There's Franzo trying to work around Savory. A little fall away in the lane doesn't go. Savory up a little bit too fast for it. Was able to tip the rebound to Baptista who will run it into the front court. Baptista back to Savory. Savory dribble drive into the lane, spins, goes up with the left hand and good. Mason Savory showing a lot yesterday. Remember last season Savory 
13 points in 21 minutes was his season high against L.A. Pierce. He eclipsed that yesterday. Really didn't get a lot of time last year. It was phenomenal yesterday for College of the Canyons as they found a multifaceted attack. Here's a rebound from Azenwa. Got it to Ortega. They'll send it to Baptista on the far side. And now Jacob Gonzalez up top. He'll work inside as Zenwa backing down the smaller man in Rubio, but missed on a little turnaround jumper. As Zenwa at 6'2, Rubio stands at 6'2 as well, but as Zenwa maybe has about 20 pounds on him inside as he's a little bit more built up in the shoulders in the midsection. Here's Brinkman working against Zenwa. A little left handed turnaround jumper is good. Brinkman yesterday was very good. The Freshman out of Ote Ranch High School with 17 points in 33 minutes. Yesterday has his first bucket. We're even at two all. Zenwa over to Baptista. Has Brinkman guarding him. We'll send it Gonzalez. Canyon's taking their time in a half-court set here. Here's Savory now with four to shoot. Needs to get one off. Got it to Ortega, shoots with one for three, no good. Saves the rebound to Zenwa, trying to get it back to Savory, it was tipped. Baptista able to pick it back up as he and Franzo were chasing it down and the Cougars will recontrol. Baptista catches on the near wing, moves to the middle of the floor. 15 footer is good. Baptista, his first bucket of the day. Four to two Canyons. Barnett and Elfara up off the bench for COC. Ready to check in at the table here. Here's Rubio, Gonzalez guarding him tightly. His pass deflected, but a foul gonna be called against Ortega here. As he reached in, trying to get the ball as Dooley was trying to catch. Elfara and Baptista in to take over for Savory and Azenwa. Rubio, elbow jumper, no good, rattled in and out. Ortega able to pick up the rebound. He'll run it up to the floor for College of the Canyons. Cougars work it inside, Elfara. Elfara on the travel, on the movement through the middle of the floor, able to take two big steps off the pass from Baptista and lays it in with the left hand. An assist from Baptista. Yamaka trying to work it around the perimeter. Here's Rubio getting into the lane. Little right-handed shot, no. Alfara, who was nearly a double-double player last year, pulls down the defensive rip. And the Cougars with a four-point lead will bring it up the floor. Cervantes getting ready to check in for Kuyamaka here. Barnett underneath the basket. Good pass from Elfara. Timeout. Kuyamaka. 8-2 run for College of the Canyons. 15-15 to go here in the first half. We'll take a timeout as well. College of the Canyons is always ready when it comes to your athletic future. With 17 intercollegiate sports programs to cheer for, opportunities for student athletes to learn, train, and compete, and a championship mindset that has produced state and national titles, College of the Canyons and the Cougars Athletics programs offer a great college experience. Take control of your athletic future at College of the Canyons. Visit canyons.edu slash schedule and cocathletics.com now. College of the Canyons with a 8-2 lead. Cougars four of seven from the floor so far, 0 of two from three. Kumaka one of eight from the floor. So the Cougars efficiency showing out here early on as they lead eight to two. So here's Rubio with the basketball for Kuyamaka as we go back to work. Brinkman over Rubio with three on the way. No, rattled in and out. Franzo the offensive board around three Cougars and puts it in. Stops a little run from COC. Ortega, soft pass taken away by Rubio. Let's Gonzalez run past him and lays it in for an easy bucket. Roz Orbach getting up off the bench, likely to take over for Ortega after that lazy pass that gives up back-to-back -back 
scores for Kuyamaka. Cervantes, by the way, checked into the game at the timeout. Here's Elfara, works it back Gonzalez. Gonzalez yesterday, six points in 29 minutes, got it inside Elfara. Little reverse lay is good. Elfara so dangerous down and near around the basket. Last year shot 68% from the floor, was eighth in the state. Shot 75% yesterday, and it's two for two so far today. Here's Rubio, Dooley, guarded tightly by Ortega. The foul line spinning, elbow jumper. That just rolled in and out, was about halfway down the cylinder and came out. Elfara able to pull down the rebound. Barnett far side of the floors. The Cougars work it back ahead. He'll play it back up top, Baptista. On the near side, Gonzalez, back to Baptista. Baptista trying to drive, dumps it off Ortega, now to Barnett. 24 foot three is good from JT Barnett. First three of the ball game for either side. And the Cougars with a 13 to six advantage, the lead 11. Brinkman got Alfara in the air, dribbles around him and lays it in with the left hand off the glass. Brinkman showing a good handle on a couple of times yesterday, doing the same thing right there as Ortega can't finish, but he draws the foul against Cervantes and will go to the line. Ortega yesterday was perfect from the line, two for two. Chance for uh, two points right here with a 13 to eight College of the Canyons lead. I guess that the lead was 11 and that was not even close to correct. My math was bad. Lead was seven, now make it six. Ortega hits bull. Orbach coming in to take over for Ortega. Jeremiah Walker in as well to take over for Jacob Gonzalez. So Canyons through their first rotation. Orduno Gorgeta back into the game for Kuyamaka. Sykes out there on the floor as well. Cervantes tries to drive. Orduno Gorgeta picks it up. Gets it back to Cervantes and will back things off. Has eight to shoot. Rubio, deep three, 26 footer is good. Nice shot from Xavier Rubio. He's got five now. And he gets it back to a four point game. Alfara at the foul line will put up a jumper. No good. Brinkman able to come away with the rebound. Got it over to Rubio. Rubio just speeding ahead. Now we'll back it off a little bit. Bounce pass inside or Duno Gregata gonna be called for a travel. Had the ball partially knocked out of his hands, was trying to keep hold of it, move, and just couldn't get it on the floor. Eight minutes gone here in the first half. Four point lead for College of the Canyons, 15 to 11, as Walker walked it up the floor. Barnett catches on the near wing, got it to Elfara, who tried to get over Orduno Gregata, who blocked it. See that often. Alfara, a very strong young man trying to get in there, but Orduno Gregata just using his size and strength as well. Knocked it away, a three on the way, no good. Alfara able to come away with the rebound with four bodies around him, got it to Walker. Walker driving right to the basket, lays it off the glass with the right hand. Little fake from Walker as he was driving towards the basket, looked like he was gonna dish off to the right and then just went right to the rack. 17 to 11, first bucket for Jeremiah Walker. Canyons back with a six point lead, Brinkman double. Walker able to force it out, Alfaro was there as well. And then Cervantes called for a foul. It's gonna be his second foul in short order as he ran into Baptista. Actually gave it to Jameer Sykes. Samevery in for Alfara. Gonzalez back in for Baptista. Canyons with a six point lead will bring it ahead. 
Barnett with the basketball in the near wing. We'll send it Gonzalez far wing. Back Barnett up top. They get it back to Barnett. He wants to drive. Little floater that doesn't go. And then a foul underneath the basket going against Koyamaka here. Goes against Patrick Brinkman for a push in the back as Savory was going up for the rebound. So the Cougars will get a reset in the basketball. Barnett. Up top, Walker, three. In rhythm, nice shot, Jeremiah Walker. Good play that time from Canyons. Lead is nine, largest of the day for College of the Canyons. Walker now with five. He and Barnett each with five in the ball game. Rubio with five on the other side. As here's a three from Dooley, no good. Savory and easy rip. And Gonzalez back the other way. Walker, Barnett. Orbach, back to Barnett. Canyons around the perimeter so far here on this possession. Barnett with 10. Inside Savory, elbow works into the lane. Stop up jumper is good, Mason Savory. And a timeout called by Ramakowski as Kuyamaka wants to talk about an 11 point lead, 9.50 to go here in the first half. College of the Canyons out in front. At Jersey Mike's, watching them freshly slice your sub is the coolest thing you'll see. And the second coolest thing you'll see is this. Woo! Here we go. Twirl. Up, up, in, hand down. One hand, one hand. Up. Woo! Up. Flip. Woo! I can eat. Slice right in front of you. The Jersey Mike's thing. A sub above. Fifty to go here in the first half. College of the Canyons with a 22 to 11 lead. Barnett and Walker each with five points for COC. Savory and O'Fara each with four. Rubio with five. Brinkman with four for Kuyamaka as we continue on here in the first half. Foul going to be called against Jeremiah Walker here for a grab around the waist. First foul on Walker. Fourth foul on College of the Canyons. Rubio, a pass that was tipped by Walker. He threw it ahead to Savory, did COC as Gonzalez got it to him. Now they get it to Orbach. He'll put up a wing three that's good. Ross Orbach, who in 10 minutes yesterday didn't have a bucket, 0 of 3 shooting, has his first points of the year as he knocks down a three. 14 point advantage, make it 12, as that's a nice shot from Dooley, a little stop up jumper from, we'll call it about 10 feet. Gonzalez and Barnett play catch here. Canyon's trying to get into a half court set that they like. Now Barnett on the far wing will put up a three over the top of Brinkman and knocks it down. That's a really nice shot from Joshua Barnett the freshman of Wharton High School in Tampa, Florida. As we said, had a point a minute yesterday. Has eight so far here today. Walker gonna be called for a foul again. That's two quick fouls on Jeremiah Walker. So he'll check out. Baptista along with the Zenwa check back in. Yeah. 
Baptista with a steal, took it right out of the hands of Rubio, will run it back up the floor and lay it in. Second basket for Baptista today. He's got four now, and the Cougars have stretched the lead out 30 to 13. Rubio with a little jump stop shot for the bucket. Give him seven. Lead down to 15. Largest has been 17 just a few seconds ago. Here's Savory trying to drive. A foul on the floor called against Cuyamaca. Went against Franzo. Ortega back into the game for COC. Zenoa has it, got it back to Ortega as the Cougars back into a half court offense. Here's Savory with seven, spinning. And a back Gonzalez with five. Now Baptista with three. Back to Gonzalez. Needs to put one up. Throws up a wild shot that did not hit the backboard. It's a shot clock violation on College of the Canyons. Took just a touch too much time, but working for that open look just couldn't get there. Rubio. Nice shot from about 15 for Xavier Rubio. He's starting to heat up with nine. Cuts the lead back to 13. Worked that shot himself in isolation against Gonzalez, was able to just slip him. There's Baptista. Canyon slowing things down a little bit here. Baptista, Ezenwa, block extended, had it blocked by Brinkman. Now Rubio steps into a three. He's fouled on the run through by Baptista. That's the second against Isaiah Baptista. So now you got Baptista with two, Walker with two. Aaron Fisher gonna elect to leave Baptista out on the floor as Rubio misses the first of two. Rubio 0 for two from the line yesterday. Makes the second, and he'll shoot a third as it's a three-shot foul. That one is good. Baptista off, Barnett back in. Yumako came out in a full court press. The Cougars able to break. Here's Savory over to Barnett. Wing three on the way is good. Barnett has it going so far today. Three for three from triple. He's got 11 in the ball game. Still six and a half to go. 14 point advantage. Sykes able to pull down the offensive rebound. Rubio with three to match Barnett's got it. Make it back an 11 point game once again. Tenga up to Barnett. Wing on the near side. Now we'll put it on the floor, trying to drive baseline. Wanted to throw it to Savory, who wasn't ready. Rubio will step into a transition. Three no good. Sykes the rebound, got it to Brinkman. Over the top of Ortega. He's called for the foul. Brinkman will go to the line. Oh, they gave it to a Zenwa here. That'll be the second on... Andrew Zenwa. Brinkman three of five from the line yesterday. Alfara getting ready to check back in. Brinkman misses the first. Brinkman splits the pair. Lead is 10. Yamaka in the bonus here, so they'll shoot one and one the rest of the way. Here's 
Savory. Gonzalez, seven. Barnett had a wing three blocked by Brinkman traveling through. Good closeout by Brinkman. Now Brinkman with Elfara on him. Cervantes tries to drive, got it to Brinkman. 20 footer from Brinkman is good. That's a really nice shot from Brinkman. Cuts the lead back to eight. Canyon's had it up to 17. Koyamaka, another takeaway. Franzo, a bounce pass. Cervantes goes off his hands and out of play. And Howard Fisher wants a timeout to talk over things. 4.45 to go here in the first half. 33-25, College of the Canyons leading. Meet Nigel Terry. In 2018, UCLA Health made him Laker for a day. Not because he beat cancer once, he beat cancer twice. He inspired us to push, to make the impossible possible. Because that's what Nigels do, and the world needs more Nigels. UCLA Health. Forty-five to go here in the first half. 33-25, College of the Canyons leading. Cougars back to work offensively here. Alfara, Orbach off the bounce pass, missed. Horbach able to pick up the rebound as the Cougars with a different look here. Let's go Mari into the game. As with both Baptista and Walker with two fouls, they'll be on the bench. Ortega tried to force that one inside. Taken away, Cervantes bumped by Gonzalez a couple of times. Cervantes gonna go to the line for a one and one. Cervantes to the line, one of two yesterday. Makes the first. Everybody confused running back up the floor as it is one and one. Second is good. Six point lead now for College of the Canyons. Alfara at the foul line, spinning against Brinkman, draws the foul. Jason Savory back up at the table, along with Sergio Franco. Alfara, who struggles from the line, was 0 for 1 yesterday. Last season struggled from the line. Alfara makes one of two. Savory in for Alfara here. Good 
Dooley. Rubio, wide open, wing three, missed it. Maybe had too much room. Savory with the rebound. He'll drop it off for Gonzalez. Brinkman, that foul was his second. He'll stay on the floor here with, floor here with two fouls. Canyons along the perimeter here. Gomari driving. Two big steps, threw it off the glass, didn't get it to go. Dooley comes away with the tip rebound. Barnett back up off the bench, so he'll get ready to come back in. Here's Rubio dribbling through traffic. Dooley, corner three. Late closeout that time from Orbach. And it's a four point game. That's where Canyon struggled at times last season. So they'd stretch leads out and then take their foot off the gas. They've seen a double digit lead evaporate back down to four points here. A little stagnant on the offensive side. Savory working against Rubio. It's a favorable matchup for Savory, who puts up a little spinning jumper in the lane that's good. Savory now with six. Lead back up to six. Franzo, or Matt closing him off. Now Rubio. Ortega guarding him, moving back to his right. Switch everything to Canyons right now. Now Cervantes, wide open, look for a wing three, no. Loose ball, jump ball, tie up. Kriamaka basketball. And Joshua Barnett will check in. Takes over for Roz Orbach. Brinkman able to get loose. Savory got hit underneath on the inbound play. And a four point lead, a 30 second timeout with a buck 50 to go. Thirty-six, thirty-two. Canyons leading. Cougars led by seventeen at one point, but they've seen that lead evaporate. As Kamaka has stayed with it here. Gonzalez wanted to get it either to Savory or Alfaro. I'm not sure who is it split the difference between both of them, and it's just a straight turnover. Franzo draws the Gonzalez foul. Second foul on Gonzalez. Franzo will go to the line. Didn't have a foul shot yesterday. His first trip to the line this season. He's Minego coming in to take over for Gonzalez here. Just like that, it's a one possession game, two foul shots good that time for Franzo. It's Go. They get it to Barnett. He'll put up a three. Barnett still feeling it. Give him 14 now. They have him as four of four, three of three from downtown, but he did have a shot block. So I believe he's three of five, and he's going to pick up his first foul right here is Rubio, who's led the way for 
Kuyamaka gonna get back to the line as he's got 14, chance to go to the line for two more here. Rubio two of three from the line, makes the first. Second is good as well with 55.3 to go. It's a three point game. Farah working against Dooley. Into the paint, got it to Savory. Wing three, corner three, I should say, air ball. Elfara got it, and then he's fouled by Brinkman. That's going to be the third foul on Brinkman. It's going to send Elfara to the line. Alfaro, one of two from the line. Makes the first. Duna Grieta checking in. Alfaro, much better on the foul shots that time around. Makes them both. Lead back up to five for COC. 30 seconds to go here in the first half. Sykes working against Barnett. Sends it duly. Manego right on top of him. Now Alfara on Dooley. They got it to Sykes. Barnett over pursues a little bit. They got it inside Franzo, but he missed. Alfara pulls down the rebound. He's doubled. Needs to dribble himself out of some trouble and draws a foul against Franzo. And that's going to send Alfara to the line for one and one. Second foul on Franzo here. So one on one here with 4.5 for Alfara. Three for his last three from the line. Jonah seven points, four rebounds, one assist. Second one rolls as well. So Alfara with four straight foul shots. Canyons lead back up to seven. Ortega, late run, doesn't make it fall. So 43-36, Canyons lead at the break. As we'll step aside, second half when we come back.
College of the Canyons is always ready when it comes to your athletic future. With 17 intercollegiate sports programs to cheer for, opportunities for student athletes to learn, train, and compete, and a championship mindset that has produced state and national titles, College of the Canyons and the Cougars Athletics programs offer a great college experience. Take control of your athletic future at College of the Canyons. Visit canyons.edu slash schedule and cocathletics.com now. Jersey Mike's watching them freshly slice your sub is the coolest thing you'll see. And the second coolest thing you'll see is this. Woo! Here we go. Twirl. Up, up, hit, two. Hand down. One hand, one hand. Up, up, up. Flip. I could eat. Slice right in front of you. The Jersey Mike's thing. A sub above. Meet Nigel Terry. In 2018, UCLA Health made him Laker for a day. Not because he beat cancer once, he beat cancer twice. He inspired us to push, to make the impossible possible. Because that's what Nigels do, and the world needs more Nigels. UCLA Health. College of the Canyons, we're always here to help make your future remarkable. Choosing classes is always flexible, so you can study your way, learn at one of our two state-of-the-art campuses, or from home with our online options. Tuition is always affordable, with classes starting at just $46 per year.
Welcome back into the Cougar Cage as we get ready for second half action between College of the Canyons and Cuyamaca. And Cougars a 43 to 36 lead at the halftime break. Look at some of the halftime stats. The Cougars shooting, excuse me, 60% from the field, 15 of 25. Cuyamaca 12 of 29 for 41.4% from the floor. College of the Canyons shooting a ridiculous 75% from three in the first half, or six of eight. Most of that coming from JT Barnett. He was four of four from three in the first half. For Cuyamaca, three of 10. Nine of 11 from the line. Cougars, seven of eight. College of the Canyons, the one knock right now. More turnovers than they need to. Seven turnovers compared to just three for Cuyamaca. Uh, Xavier Rubio, 16 points in the first half. Joshua Barnett with 14 to lead the way for College of the Canyons. The only two players on either side in double figures with Jonah Alfara and Patrick Brinkman each at nine points. It'll be College of the Canyons basketball here to start the second half as they have the possession arrow. As they will move to our right here in the second. A seven point advantage to open things up as it'll be Gonzalez, Baptista, Savory, Ortega and Izenwa for College of the Canyons. Sykes, Brinkman, Dooley, Rubio, and Franzo for Cuyamacas. The Cougars tried to set up a Savory alley-oop that was deflected away by Savory as Brinkman was there to defend him. And it'll be a turnover on their first possession, much like the same they did in the first half. Rubio driving. Went high off the glass, couldn't get it out. Savory is down and Savory is hurt. That is not good for COC. Mason Savory has been strong so far through two games. Medical staff, Howard Fisher walking out as well. He was on his stomach for few extra seconds. And so they'll check on Mason Savory here. Yesterday he was in and out of the game, kept getting cuts on his head. He had a cut on his ear, cut underneath his, I think he bloodied his nose a little bit. And I didn't see what happened as he went down. He looks like he's gonna hop up. He gets his right arm as he swings it around. Maybe went down on it hard, so he'll check out. GT Barnett will come in as the big for COC. Barnett listed as a forward, but shoots much like a guard. It's very much in a lengthy guard play is really where he is at. If he likes to play along the perimeter, that's much different than Savory, who's more of a traditional forward 6'6". Six, six. Barnett at 6'6 six, six doesn't give up any sizes. Yamako will go back to work. Sprinkman drops Dooley. Rubio with three. Gonzalez in his space, so it's a three-point shot here for Rubio, and he'll go to the line for three shots. Gonzalez picks up his third foul on the really just the second or third play of this second half. Rubio knocks down the first. Rubio with 17. He's five of six from the line. Chance to cut the lead back to four here as he makes the second. Knocks down all three. So gets the three the hard way. And it's a four point game, 43-39. Canyon's just a turnover as Ortega got trapped in the corner. Sykes around Baptista. 
It's a one possession game, 43-41. Miyamaka the better of it here to start the second half as the Cougars have not scored in the first minute. Meanwhile, Kuyamaka with five points already in this second half. There's Baptista delaying. Nearly threw it away. Three to shoot. Baptista will step into a deep three that's no good. Rubio, the long rebound pickup, a chance to tie the game. Dropped it off to Brinkman. Brinkman working against Ortega, and we are tied at 43 all. So it's a fresh ball game here with 18 minutes to go. First time we've been tied since. Way back in the first half at 2-2. Canyons has led the whole way. Yamaka looking for their first lead of the ball game and Franzo gonna get to the line. Walker, Savory, and Elfara up off the bench. Yamaka looking for their first lead of the ball game. Franzo makes it, and Kuyamaka has a one-point lead. First lead of the game for Kuyamaka. Last time we were tied 17-21 in the first half. So Canyons has led for approximately 20 minutes. Now finds themselves behind for the first time today. They trail by two. Alfaro, Walker, Barnett, Baptista, and Savory on the floor. Zenwa picked up his third foul on that last possession for Kuyamaka. Sykes going to be called for a foul here on a reach in, trying to steal the pass from Savory. For Sykes, it's his second. Barnett. Barnett, little stutter step, dumps to Alfara and finishes with two hands. Barnett with a nice assist. Alfara into double figures with 11. Here's Rubio driving, dumps underneath. Dooley an easy lay in as the Cougars over pursued on the defensive side. Dooley now with seven. Two-point Kuyamaka lead, 47-45. Savory, tough pass for Alfara to handle, but he's able to collect it. Now we'll send it Walker. Walker, a wide open look for three is no good. Savory cutting through, picks up the rebound, kicks it back out, Baptista. Baptista tries to draw the foul and does. It's gonna go against Rubio. It'll be Rubio's first, and it'll send Baptista to the line for a pair of foul shots. Baptista, who had 24 yesterday with just four points today. He's two of four from the floor. Cervantes getting ready to check back in. TC yesterday, one of one from the line. Misses the first short. Sykes off. Baptista splits, so it's a one point game. Franzo gets an open look. It's a three-point lead. Baptista driving right to the bucket, drops it for Barnett, who lays it in. Baptista a little out of control, but able to get it to Barnett for the finish. So the teams trade points on either side. Cougars getting out and running. They have not been able to do that today. That was where they got the lead yesterday against Barstow when they were able to get out and run a little bit. 
Just have not been able to do that today against the tough Kuyamaka defense. Tries to throw it inside. Barnett now, wing three on the way, no good. Walker couldn't come down with the rebound. Poked the ball away from Rubio. Walker gets a strip, able to steal it away from Rubio. Now Savory catches block on the far side, works into the paint, over the top of Brinkman, no good. Still a one point Kuyamaka lead here. Sucks back into the ball game. Cervantes. Got it to David Brinkman into the game for the first time. Canyon's able to get a steal as Barnett took it away. Barnett ahead, Elfara underneath lays it in. Good pass from Barnett, good finish from Elfara. Timeout, Rob Wachowski. Canyon's now back in front, 50-49. to 14-48 to go as we'll take a break. Meet Nigel Terry. In 2018, UCLA Health made him Laker for a day. Not because he beat cancer once, he beat cancer twice. He inspired us to push, to make the impossible possible. Because that's what Nigels do, and the world needs more Nigels. UCLA Health. So a lighter schedule on the Cougar Sports Network next week if you are joining us for more athletic contests here on YouTube. Women's volleyball against West LA on the 8th and then soccer on the 10th against Santa Monica. Sophomore day for the women's soccer team. And then football on Saturday against Ventura. I think I said Saturday for women's soccer, but it's actually Friday for women's soccer. Canyons gets another takeaway as that one went off of Savory. Walker driving, throws it off the glass, draws the foul against Rubio. It'll be the second foul against Rubio. It'll send Walker to the line for the first time today. The first time this season. Barnett 16, Elfara 13 and four. Rubio 19 and four assists with three rebounds. Brinkman 11 points and three boards. Walker makes the first, lead back up to two, chance to get it to three. Walker now with seven points in the ball game. 52-49 is Cervantes for Cuyamaco bringing up the floor. Baptista right on him. Cervantes driving, kicks it Sykes, now Rubio. Rubio a little step back as he worked to his left. A good three to tie the ball game at 52. As Walker will speed it back up the floor. Walker's pass knocked away by Cervantes. Rubio on a run out around Baptista. No, it goes off of Cervantes and it'll be Canyon's basketball. Julian Franzo after a spell up off the bench. They'll check in at the table. Going to 
Gonzalez back in to take over for Jeremiah Walker, and the Cougars turn it over on the inbound pass. Fontes trying to drive against Gonzalez, got it into Sykes. Sykes around Savory, couldn't get the roll. Savory able to pick up the rebound. He's doubled down low, fights out of it, and got it to Baptista. Gonzalez mishandles on the run. And another Canyons turnover. Ten turnovers in the ballgame on COC. Brinkman with Elfara on it, closes off the baseline. Got it back to Franzo. Franzo over Barnett from 18, no good. Baptista the rebound. We'll dump it to Savory, who will bring it up the floor. Savory off the Elfara. Elfara going to be called for a moving screen here. First foul on Jonah. So we're stuck at 52 all, 13.02 to go. Dooley working against Barnett. Now to Brinkman up top, guarded by Elfara. There's Cervantes. Slips a couple of defenders, got down low. Foul called on the floor against Jacob Gonzalez. That'll be the... Fourth foul on Jacob Gonzalez. Barnett off, Ortega in. Gonzalez gonna stay out there with four fouls. Alfara defensive rip that time. Got inside position against Brinkman off the miss from Kuyamaka. Now Baptista. Out to Ortega, we'll work back up high. Baptista, five, fall away jumper from the foul line, no. Alfara, the offensive rebound, goes back up with it and puts it in. Alfara now, 15.6 boards, two point Canyons lead. Dooley had an open look at three, decided not to take it. Got it over Franzo, spins baseline, backs off Elfara, but he's going to be called for an offensive foul. Third foul against Sergio Franzo here. Two point Canyons lead. Savory, who's quieted down. Savory stepped on the sideline on the pass, and it'll be Kriamaka basketball. Jose Orduno Gregeta coming in to take over for Sergio Franco here. Franco listed his two fouls on the live stats, but. They say he has three out on the floor, so. Keep an eye on that. Here's Rubio, steps into a three, too strong. Elfara with the rebound. Give him seven now in the ball game. Here's Baptista, Savory. Inside Elfara. Was trying to dump to Gonzalez. It goes out off of Canyons. Cougars offense just out of sync here. In this second half, credit to Cuyamaca defense. They've played very tightly. After giving up 43 points in the first half, they've only yielded 11 here in the second. Dooley drives off the glass with the left hand is good. We're tied at 54. Again, Canyon's trying to force one inside. Stolen by Kuyamaka. 
They work it around to Dooley. Three-pointer from the wing is short. Tip rebound came to Rubio. His shot doesn't fall. Elfara with the rebound. Got it to Savory on the outlet. Savory into traffic over to Ortega. Ortega just has it stolen right away from him from Rubio, who lays it up for Sykes. On an alley-oop. And a timeout called by Howard Fisher. 56-54. College of the Canyons trailing Cuyamacus. Ramukowski with a little laugh after that. And we'll take a timeout. Fifty-six, fifty-four. Can we mock out in front? Had a little showtime a few moments ago from Sykes and Rubio. They give themselves the two-point lead. Canyon's going with fresh five out on the floor. It's Menego, Ezenwa, Walker, Barnett, and Orbach here. Ezenwa. Right-handed runner, and then he's going to be called for a foul trying to go after the rebound. It's going to be the fourth on Andrew Zenwa here. So now you have Zenwa and Gonzalez each with four. It's the fifth foul on Canyons here in the second half. Kuyamaka trying to stretch their lead a little bit here. Brinkman with the Zenwa right on it. Got it underneath Sykes. Back to Brinkman. Zenwa with a block. Walker the other way. Two on one for Canyons if they hurry. Manego the finish at the rack with the left hand. Well executed two on one for Canyons that time on a fast break in transition. We're even at 56 all. Dooley, air ball on the three point attempt from the corner. Landed right in the lap of Zenwa. Here's Barnett now with it on the far wing for Canyons. Up to Walker. Back Barnett. Now Zenwa. Underneath Orbach. Walker. Extra pass. Barnett. Barnett. Stop up jumper. Nice shot from about 12. Barnett now with 18. He's been quiet in the second half. We had 14 in the first half. Just four here in the second, but Canyon's back in front, 58-56. Rubio, a pass off of Manego. Substitutions with Cervantes and Franco coming back in. It's a one point led by 17. Cleomaca's largest lead has been two. As Canyons gets a stop. Trying to stretch things back out here. Here's Barnett. Walker going to run through. Barnett going to work to the left. Dumps it inside. Orbach over Franzo. Hit the side of the backboard. Fights for the rebound and gets it. Here's Walker with 10. Over Barnett on the wing, a three on the way, no good. Walker the rebound. Back to Orbach in the corner, and the Cougars will reset here. Zenwa inside, had it. 
maybe blocked a bit from behind. Miyamaka able to come down with the rebound. Sykes trying to run around Orbach, and a foul going to be called against Orbach as he kind of runs Sykes off the floor. It's a good setup from Barnett to Azenwa on the inside. Jonah Alfara back into the game. what the delay was, but we go back to work. Cervantes a three for the lead, it's good. Cervantes. Now with five, and Kuyamaka back with a one point lead. Here's Ofara. Lost it, is Zenwa on the floor with it. And a timeout called by College of the Canyons. That was a smart timeout by Barnett. As he saw Izenwa pick up the basketball, called the timeout. So Canyons will go back to work with it. It's a 30-second timeout, 59-58. Kuyamaka in the lead. Rubio with 22, six assists, four boards, five steals in the ballgame. He has been supremely active. Three of six from the field, or from three-point. Six of 15 from the floor. Only Patrick Brinkman, the other... Coyote in double figures with 11 points, four rebounds. For College of the Canyons, Joshua Barnett, 18 points, one rip, three assists. Jonah Alfara, 15 points, six rebounds, and an assist. And then Walker with seven, Savory with six, Baptista with five. On the other side, Dooley with nine, Franza with eight, and Cervantes with five. So. Just a pair of players and double figures for each side. It's a defensive struggle so far here today. Canyons was supremely efficient on offense in the first half. They're six of 12 from three. You remember they were shooting 75% from three in the first half. As Elfara off the inbound gets an easy bucket. There's an offensive foul called against Franco here. It's going to be the third against Sergio Franco. Dooley going to check in. And now it's the fourth on Franco. Sorry. Dooley back in for Rubio. So Rubio going to get a spell right now in a one point ball game. Walker, Manego, Barnett, 12-footer no good. Elfara the rebound, works it back out Walker. It's a man to run by him, got it back to Barnett at the foul line, dumped it underneath to Izenwa, came back to Walker, draws the foul as he went up. Foul is either Brinkman or Franzo. If it's Franzo, it's his fifth, and that's Franzo, it is his fifth. So Franzo out of the game with five fouls. Rubio just a 30-second rest. Orduno Gregata back in as Cervantes coming out as well. And Barnett to the line for the first time today. Each team with six fouls. Kumaka three timeouts left. College of the Canyons two. Barnett misses the first. Barnett two of two yesterday from the line. Second is good. Sykes, 12 footer, no. Elfara, another rebound. Give him eight in the ball game. Approaching a double double. 
Did that 10 times last year. Walker barking out instructions. Menego back to Walker inside Barnett. Was trying to slip it underneath to Alfaro when I probably could have put up a shot. Instead, it's Rubio the other way. Transition three short. Brinkman the rebound, knocked away from him. And Zenwa picks it up and will dribble it ahead. Got it to Barnett on the wing. Now Walker. Now Barnett, Zenwa underneath. Fouled, coming through was Rubio. Howard Fisher up off the bench saying what we're all thinking to Joshua Barnett. Man, you've been red hot today. Shoot the ball from the foul line when you're wide open. Instead he gets the foul on Rubio. It's gonna be his third as Zenwa to the line. Misses the first of two. Cervantes back in, Sykes off. Zenwa one of two. Lead back up to three, 62-59. Tight game here, Clash of Canyons 2023 championship game. Rio stops his dribble, had to drop it to Brinkman. Brinkman trying to take Alfara off the dribble. Foul called against Joshua Barnett is second. And it sends Kuyamaka to the line for one and one here. Both teams in the bonus now, each with seven fouls. Dooley to the line. Shoot one and one. Dooley, no foul shots yesterday. None today. So his first trip to the line of the season makes the first. Second is no good. Ninth rebound for Elfara. They don't come much easier than that for him. Walker picked up his dribble. We'll get it to Barnett. Underneath is Zenwa off the glass as Arduno Gurgieta couldn't rotate around fast enough. And the lead back to four for College of the Canyons. 5.15 to go. Robokowski calling a timeout. 514 left, 6460 COC. Timeout on the floor, we'll take it as well. Sixty-four, sixty. Kuyamaka basketball as we go back to work. Canyons out in front. Brinkman will put up a three. No good. Brinkman didn't try a three at all yesterday. That time had an open look and just didn't hit it. Zenwa checking out. Savory coming back in. Sykes checking back in. Taking over for Aduno Gregeta. Oh, 
So it's Canyons basketball. They say it tipped off of Canyons first, and then they said it tipped off of Koyamaka. And they said it tipped off of Savory last. Of course, no replay in the 3C2A, so we can't look at it. Neither can the officials. So it stays a four-point game. Four and a half here to go. Brinkman, Rubio, got a little trouble on the handle, goes baseline, dumps it underneath, Sykes, no good. And then a foul on Brinkman as he tied up Savory underneath. It'll be the fourth on Patrick Brinkman here. Savory to the line. Seven of seven yesterday. Makes the first of the one and one here. Stretches the lead to five, a chance to get it to six. Mason knocks them both down. Savory now with eight points. Canyons with a six point lead. Rubio brings it ahead. Cervantes. Now Brinkman. Alfaro right in his hip pocket. Fell off him for a second, but Brinkman had stopped the dribble. Now Rubio. Step back, tries to draw a foul and does. Walker going to send Rubio to the line for three foul shots for the third time today. I know they actually give Rubio two. So Rubio to the line for two shots. For Walker's third foul. Rubio makes them both. Here's Barnett, guarded by Rubio. Savory, Cervantes on him. Savory able to keep a hold of it here. Bounce pass inside, Brinkman tipped it away. Savory picks it back up, puts it back on the floor. Two big steps into the paint and lays it in with the left hand. Good recovery from Mason Savory that time. Shows his athleticism on the finish. Now Brinkman, Alfaro right with him. There's Rubio Walker trying to stay with Rubio, gets into the paint. Shorted on a left-hand layup, was looking for a foul. Didn't get it. Alfaro, huge screen that knocked Rubio down. Opens up a three from Anego is good. 71-62, timeout Kuyamaka. 2.53 to go. Rubio walked over towards the bench. The officials kind of separating everybody out here. And timeout, Kuyamaka. That's a huge three for Manego. Rubio ran right in to Alfara, who had his feet planted, it looked like. At least from up here, and the officials thought the same thing. And it's not football, so in the in, in the SCFA, which you would see next Saturday, or in the NCAA, if you see a block like that, which would be a, it'd be a cutback block in the NFL, it'd be a foul. But I guess in the NBA, it's uh, or in the NBA, in the uh, basketball ranks, no such thing.
So Coyotes with one timeout left. Canyons with two. 2.53 to go. It's a nine-point College of the Canyons lead. Off the three from Kaziz Manego, his first three of the uh, day in his second bucket of the ball game. He's got five points now. Sykes trying to shake off Savory. Now Brinkman, who's been locked up a bit by Elfara, hasn't been able to get loose today. Yesterday, Brinkman had a good game. He's only got 11 here today. Dooley, a three that was blocked, but Sykes able to catch. Puts up a jumper, no. Brinkman catches the miss and puts it in. So right on cue, as we said, Brinkman been locked up a little bit here in the second half, able to find an easy basket. Walker up across the timeline. Slips back to the middle of the field. Manego, Savory in the corner. Savory wants to drive, spinning. Couldn't draw the foul from Brinkman. Missed on the shot as Brinkman altered it. Sykes back the other way on a transition layup. It's good. Four quick points for Kuyamaka. Five point lead once again for COC, 145 to go. Barnett, right hand, no, got his own rebound, put back, no, another tip, no, and then he tips the third one in. Barnett with 21. Canyon's back with a seven-point lead. Barnett, 21. Elfara, double-double, 17 and 10. Savory with 10 and 6. There's Dooley into the corner. Cervantes, a three, air ball. Savory catches with 108, hands it off to Walker. Walker gets it across the timeline. S throws it out of bounds. Kuyamaka trying to trap, so it's a Canyon's turnover. Baptista gonna come in for Walker here. Tenga checking back in. Manego coming off. Yamako will bring it in for the Cougars. No fouls here as you lead by seven. Rubio with three. Ortega going to be called for the foul. Score the bucket for Rubio. They called it on Baptista. Baptista, his third. Rubio can make it a one possession game. Huge shot from Xavier Rubio, who's got 24 now. Give him 25. It's a one possession game. Actually, give him 28. Sorry, the score sheet ticks ahead. Canyon needs to get across the timeline, and they do. Ortega to Savory. Now, Savory once again. Savory with six, lost the ball, got it back, threw it away. Rubio on the steal, chance to make it a one-point game. Offensive foul called against Rubio. Barnett with his feet outside the restricted area, draws the charge. Fourth foul on Xavier Rubio. Timeout called by College of the Canyons. 73-70 with 18.6. So the fourth on Rubio, ninth on Kuyamaka, 18.6. The next foul puts Kuyamaka in, or puts Canyons in the plus. Same on the other side for Kuyamaka. It's a three-point game.
Barnett to bring it in. Got it to Baptista ahead Ortega. Ortega just dribbling around. Canyons got it to Gonzalez who's fouled and Ortega, or excuse me, uh, Rubio fouls out of the ball game. His fifth. Kuyamaka going to take a timeout here. <laughs> 30-second timeout. David Brinkman back to the line or back to the floor. Gonzalez will be at the line. So two shots for Gonzalez here, who misses the first. Need the second to make it a two possession game. Gonzalez yesterday two of three from the line. Second is good. Walker will check in for Gonzalez. So it's a four point game, 10.5. If you're Canyons, you just need to defend for a couple more seconds here and make him run up the floor. Sykes will put up a deep three, no good. Walker, the rebound, will hold on to it, and Canyons will take the clash for the fourth year running, 74 to 70 over Kuyamaka. As they come away with a victory, Xavier Rubio, 28 points in the loss for Kuyamaka. For College of the Canyons, Joshua Barnett, 21 points, three rebounds, and four assists in the win. Jonah Elfara, 17 points, 10 rebounds, a double-double for COC. As they come away the victor, that'll do it for us here on the Cougar Sports Network. Thank you for joining us this weekend. We hope to see you next week for more action. Check the YouTube page for our upcoming schedule. Have a good rest of your Saturday, everybody.